will show you how to build a small AI agent with Dagger. Um, so an AI agent, first of all, is an automated program that is using an LLM and some functions that you implement and that the LLM can call on demand based on what's needed. And the advantage of using Dagger for that is that the, 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 any LLM can use any function from the Dagger API, including mod Dagger modules that we, you implement yourself. And so for this demo, I will show you how to optimize a Docker file. And so I will take this simple app and I will give it to my agent and the agent will look for a Docker file and look for optimizations to do and submit a new pull request. And all of this will be done without me inter, um, you know, interfacing with the agent. I will just run it and that's it. So let's look at how this works. And then um, I will show you the code uh, right after. So you can, you can apply this to your own use case. So I will uh, launch the agent using the Dagger shell with one simple command. I will call the function optimize Docker file from GitHub. Uh, it's, it's a module that I implemented um, that it takes a GitHub token from the environment to interact with my Git repo. And the second argument of the function is the, the, the repository itself to, to work with. So I will run this. So I see a bunch of instructions happening in the terminal. Um, the LLM starts doing its work. I can see that there are some, some input tokens and output tokens uh, being processed. And I will uh, follow this in Dagger Cloud to see what's going on. It's, it's usually easier to, to know what's um, uh, too easier to navigate the graph. So here I can see the, the, the prompt that was um, entered. And the interesting thing is I can see the LLM calling specific tools from my uh, from the Dagger API and from my module. So here, for instance, I can see that it's looking for the Docker file. It reads the content, figure out what kind of optimization can be done based on uh, the size of the image, but also based on the security. Here, I see another bunch of instructions. So when it cannot um, successfully optimize the image the first time, it will retry. And so that that's um, the, so there is this loop that the LLM is doing, uh, interfacing with the with the Dagger API along the way. All right. So as soon as um, the LLM is done finishing the work, it will write a description of uh, the changes to include in the pull request. So I go back to my initial repo repositories, and and so this is the the repo of my example app that I showed earlier. And see that this is the the pull request that the agent just opened. So I can find the, the the same description that I saw earlier in from from the Dagger Cloud interface, and the interesting thing is now there I can see a check that has that that just started on on GitHub, and this check is actually another agent that picked up the change from the first agent, and then he's basically reviewing the pull request. So you have a whole automated flow of one agent doing a piece of work and another agent doing another part of the work. So the interesting thing for a maintainer is that imagine a bigger project where you have a couple of agents like that that are focused on, on different tasks. And the, the, the advantage of using Dagger to implement that, this kind of agent is that the agent can have a complete container API to clone some code, run some tests, start some container, Etc. And, and every time grab the output and do something with it. Let's quickly look at the, the code um, to, to see um, how I implemented this, um, this agent. So for the Docker file optimizer, uh, the way it's being built is, so the, there is the main function that I called, let's start there. Um, so you see optimize Docker file from GitHub. And then um, the agent takes a workspace. So the workspace is actually the, it's kind of the toolbox that you want to give to the agent. I go to the workspace, I can see that it's um, it's it's a Dagger module and the workspace has a read, a write and a build. That's the only thing I want the agent to be able to do. So now let's quickly look at the PR reviewer one. Uh, this one is, is actually much simpler. Um, it just, it basically takes the diff. Um, so, so we provide, everything about the PR to the to the LLM and we ask it to to provide a recommendation. 
So thanks for listening. Um, as a next step, I would recommend to go to docs.dagger.io slash AI dash agents. And that's that's actually the, the perfect starting point to start building your own agent uh, with the Dagger API. Thanks for listening.